Hey guys, how y'all do? How y'all doing today? And anyway, today, today, guys, what I want to talk about is I want to talk about this um rumor I heard, <laughs> and I found the rumor on Jamatsu dot com, and I'm not sure if this is real or not. So if anybody has any room, has any, you know, if anybody can confirm this, that'd be great. And what it basically says is, there's there's going to be a new. Uh, come on, all right. Yeah, there's going to be a new Inspector Gadget game called Inspector Gadget Mad Time Party announced for the PS5, PS4, Switch, and PC. And it says due out this fall. And again, I want you guys to just you know. Just ignore what the heck was going on a little while ago. Sorry about that. Anyway, let's uh, let's get on with it. Oh, and this article was published by Mr. Sal Romano today at 4.15 a.m. Eastern District Time. Really? So let's get on with it. All right. Publisher Mick R- Mike Royds. Sorry if I don't pronounce that right. And developer Smart Tail Game, Smart Tail Games have announced Inspector Gadget Mad Time Party for the PlayStation 5, PlayStation 4, Switch, and PC. That'd be Steam. It will launch this fall. Really? Really? <laughs> well, again, I want you guys to treat this right now as if it's just a rumor, okay? As if it's just a rumor right now, okay? And here's what they say about the game. This new party game for one to four players will immerse you in the iconic world of Inspector Gadget. Stroll through the environments of the original series, meet characters such as Chief Quimby, Penny, or the Mad Agents, and use the variety of gadgets of the Inspector to fight the Mad Forces. Wowzers. Play as the iconic Inspector Gadget. And join your friends in this new party game. Metro City has fallen under the control of the evil Dr. Claw. In order to save the city, Inspector Gadget must use a time machine to go back in time. Wait a minute. That sounds familiar, doesn't it? In order to save the city, Inspector Gadget must use a time machine to go back in time. Guys, doesn't that sound a little familiar to anybody else? I'm not kidding. I'm not kidding about this. This, uh, this, that part sounds hauntingly familiar to me. And I want you guys to think back to about 1989 and a movie called Back to the Future Part 2. Yeah, when Marty and Doc have to go back to 1955 to correct. The mistake that Biff Tanning caused. Yeah. Anyway. Unfortunately, the ins- the machine breaks down. The inspector's ancestors are teleported to the present. What the fuck? That doesn't make any sense. So let me get this straight. Gadget has to go back in time to, to save the city... But the machine breaks down, and his ancestors are teleported to the present. That makes absolutely no sense at all. Your mission. Explore Metro City and confront Inspector Gadget's ancestors to recover the missing parts of the machine. You'll have to solve minigame quests in order to unlock the bolts needed to repair it. Really? Oh, and uh, key features. Embark on a fun and exciting adventure as the legendary Inspector Gadget and save Metro City from Dr. Claw. Well, that's obvious. But, of course, we all know that Penny and Brain, really, they were the ones who really stopped, really fought all of Mad's plans. Gadget never actually, never actually foiled any of his plans, to tell you the truth. <laughs> Explore Metro City and complete quests and challenges in, in adventure mode. Really? Complete quests and challenges in adventure mode. Really? Discover 16 entertaining minigames inspired by the Inspector Gadget 
universe, such as Count Them All, My Precious, and Pass the Bomb. So, is Pass the Bomb anything like... Keep Away or something like that? I guess? I don't know. <laughs> um, have fun with family and friends in multiplayer mode. That's cool. That's cool. Enjoy the exceptional soundtrack created by, by Tennis Chaplin, the daughter of the Inspector Gadget creator Jean Chaplin. Again, I'm sorry, mis sorry if I'm mispronouncing that name. Best pronunciation I can give. And here's the first here's the first screenshot that you guys can clearly see. Alright. There's that. There's that. Alright. Alright. That's cool, man. This is cool. So wait, what's going on here? Okay. That's wait, that's that lady who owns the who runs that spa that was in that was in one of the original series episodes. I believe it was episode number six, I think. And and of course there's Dr. Claw and Brain, who by the way were both voiced by Frank Welker, if I remember correctly. <laughs> yeah, so what do I think of this? What do I think of this trailer? I mean, what do I think of this? It's awesome. I have no I have no objections to this. It looks like this might actually be this be the title screen. Inspector Gadget's Mad Time Party. Oh god. And as you guys can clearly see, it's coming out for PlayStation 5, PlayStation 4, and the Nintendo Switch, and the PC. So, yeah. So, what do I what do I think of it? That's awesome, you guys. So, here's a, qu here's a question I have. And I know I'm probably going to be proven... I'm probably going to be proven to be a complete idiot. But if they're going to have to... Use okay. Since they're probably not going to be able to get all the original cast back, here's here's a suggestion, okay? Why not get people who can who can at least do a half decent impression of these characters? You know, like who can do a half decent impression, like for Gadget, I'm guessing unless he's already passed away, get Maurice LaMarche to do it. I don't know. For Penny, um, no. Well, if you can't get Chris Summer, then uh, I guess Tara Strong would be your would be your only uh, would be is the only possibility left. Unless her voice Penny and Gadget and the Gadgetinis is 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 still alive, and if she is, get her to do it. I don't know. <sighs> Brain? If you can't get Frank Welker to voice him and Claw, then at least get someone who can at least do a half decent, you know, who can do it, who can at least do his voice at least half decent. Or, and this is a big or, use archival audio from the original series if you have to, okay? If you have to do it, do it that way. And save yourself all the trouble, people. So do I so right now am I treating this am I treating this as a fact? Not at all. Right now, and, and until this is confirmed, I say it's just a rumor, and let's just keep it at that, okay? But I just want to get my thoughts on this article. Yeah, I just wanted to get my thoughts on this on this article. Yeah. So, what do you guys think? Do you guys think this game's actually gonna actually gonna come out? Oh, and uh, here's another thing that needs to happen. Okay, when this game comes out, if it does come out, what needs to come? It needs to come out with a physical release 
trust me on this one. Oh yeah. So so what I so what would I give this what do I give this um what do I give this article in terms of in terms of a rating? Out of ten I'm gonna give it about a seven maybe six and a half definitely yeah so what do you guys think if this does turn out to be true are you guys looking forward to this or is this something like you're just gonna say nah i think i'll just um i think i'll just wait for some for some other game to come out <laughs> oh and uh no this is not gonna be on the xbox whatever they're on yeah so uh So, yeah, so if you guys are looking forward to this, then who knows? I guess we'll have to wait and see if they ever, if, you know, PlayStation and, you know, anything from Nintendo, and ever, ever if they ever announce anything about this. So if they do, let's just hope they can find a way to actually, you know, get this right okay because sometimes when they bring out games that are based on you know old properties yeah they kind of screw them up a little yeah so let's just wait and see how much let's wait and see if they announce anything about this and uh, and if they do i kind of hope to god that it, you know it turns out to be really good of course <laughs> Yeah, so, yeah, so that's my thoughts on it, you guys. So why don't you go ahead and give me your thoughts on what you think about this, all right? And remember, guys, treat this as just a rumor right now. Not a solid fact. It's just a rumor. Just wanted to get my thoughts on it. That is all. And, guys, till next time.